Distracted drivers are once again in police sights. This month, patrols will be cracking down on mobile phone use in an operation which has already nabbed thousands. But this time, it's a double-edged blitz. A peak hour crackdown on unsuspecting drivers. Nine news cameras captured the sting on motorists using mobiles at Gilberton this morning. Well, frankly, um, using mobile phones would have to be one of the more dangerous things that's happening on our road. And police are focusing on the deadly habit during Operation Distraction this month. Two hands out on the wheel and their minds on something else. So anything we can do to cut that down is a really good idea. Look, I don't touch the phone while I'm driving, but it certainly would have an impact if I was tempted to maybe pick up a call or something that might look urgent. I would certainly think twice if I knew that they were looking for that. When run last year, almost 3,000 motorists were caught in just two months. Research shows that using a mobile phone while driving increases the risk of a crash by at least four times. Speed is another major crash factor. And residents at Burton are fed up with it on this 50 kilometre an hour stretch of Bolivar Road. I would love to see that out on the raceway, no worries, but in front of my house, no. On Saturday afternoon, a 21-year-old driver was caught speeding at nearly 150 kilometres an hour, almost three times the speed limit. It's absolutely disgusting. I, have to, I don't think they have no respect whatsoever, especially when you've got school children coming out of here. The Salisbury man's car has been impounded for a month. Locals now demanding a fixed camera on the road to deter speeding drivers. Well, live now to Harvey Biggs and Harvey Motorists will be under intense scrutiny this month. Yeah, that's right, Brenton. Every officer on the beat has been directed as to target distracted drivers, especially those using mobile phones at intersections and traffic lights. As you know, it's been a horrific start to the year on our roads, and the high road toll is part of the reasoning behind bringing this operation on. It's also why police will be targeting seatbelts this month, particularly in regional areas. One in five people killed on South Australian roads was not wearing a seatbelt. So the message is buckle up and don't use your phone. Brenton? Doing the right thing. Thank you.